Hello, hello. What's up, everybody? Welcome back. All right, you guys. Next up, we have my Jazzy Live. And you know what? Um, my Jazzy Live, she has a new home. She, yep, she, she come on, y'all. A, a lot of us already knew this. <laughs> she been had a house. But yeah, she has a new home. And guess what? You would think that, okay, she don't need the people's money anymore. She's not going to ask us for anything else since she's already into her new house, right? Oh, no, 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 no. Jasmine said, I have a new house, but I still want your money. You guys, please, I need your money. I need to get this. I need to get that. I need everything. All right, so let me go ahead and share my screen real quick. And we're going to start with this video. This is the first video that she put out last night. So it says, move into a homeless shelter and selling our stuff. Last option, single with five kids. Okay, let's start it right here. Um, doing some last minute sales, selling things. I sold my couch. Um, now I'm about to sell my table, um, to get the rest of my money for this move. I need now, you know what? One of Jasmine's people, they would, they would think that Jasmine is selling her stuff, um, because she wants the money. I beg to differ. I think she's selling it because she's like another Nika. She doesn't want to move it. That's what it is. She doesn't want to move it. And then also she wants everybody to think, okay, well, it's all these reactors out here. They're making sense. And the people, they're not really donating to me. So maybe if I go ahead and sell some of my stuff, maybe they'll see that I'm, a, I'm in dire needs and I really do need some extra cash. Stop playing with me. Stop playing. Uh, you already had the house right now while you were moving. So what were you needing extra funds for? Come on, come on, come on. Okay, so I guess the dude, he came over there and he grabbed the, um, the furniture. Okay. Cash into the cash app. All right, y'all. So table's gone. I know I look crazy, y'all. It just looks so empty in here now. Like y'all. It's making me sad. I was here for three years. Three is making me sad. I love this house. I'm really getting emotional at this point. You know how when it starts to hit you and it's just hitting me. Like I love my house. I love the memories that I built here. I brought my son home here. I'm trying not to cry because it was just a lot of memories, you know? I started, like, I guess you could say, like, a blended family here. Like, I didn't really start it there. You know, Jasmine always thinking that she only has one child. I brought my son home here. Like, you know, one would think, oh, okay, okay. She must just only got one kid. If it was somebody new watching her, they'd be like, oh, okay, so she only has one child. But why does this say single with five kids if she only just talking about bringing home one child? You know, they wouldn't, they wouldn't be thinking like, oh, oh, you know, like. Just it more so started here. We made more memories here together. Yeah, only because Chris was there. Girl, move on. All right. You should be happy to get rid of that. This Because it seemed as though this house was a burden on Jasmine because she was not able to keep up with the... Uh, so she says she wasn't able to, you know, the rent was too much for her, basically. You know, so one would think that she would be happy to, you know, get up out of here. 
But I can understand her, you know, feeling a certain type of way because she was there for three years. I believe she was here longer than she's been at any other place that she stayed at. So. I don't know. It's just kind of got me sad right now. I'm kind of in my feelings and I'm just. Stay strong, Jazz. Stay strong, girl. You got this. One thing at a time. One thing at a time. I'm sorry, y'all. Okay. I got the stuff out of here that's leaving. Um, my other stuff is going to be packed and moved tomorrow. I don't even want to talk about this right now. It's emotional. Hey you guys, welcome back to another vlog. There's Think Above right there. We're about to head out. I have so much stuff I have to do today, and I'm a little irritated because I don't know. I'm, I'm just gonna have to go see what's going on um, with my lights. They're just these people are irritating me. I know that they're a local place, so I'm gonna go there and see what they say because it's just a lot. And I have to go pick up the kids. Um, and I have to go get the kids' school clothes. I have a lot of stuff I have to do today. It's just. I feel like I'm ripping and running. All right, you guys. So it's been a day. I have not picked up the camera because I've just been moving around, doing stuff um, all day. And going back and forth, going to this P.O. box, trying to get a P.O. box and for my sponsorships and stuff. And then on top of that, um, i just been doing a lot, like a lot of moving around. I see. All right, y'all. Um, so we're just waiting right now because I'm picking up some stuff. But... Um, yeah, I was trying to get a P.O. box, but it's a whole complicated thing. Like, I need to get a new ID. It's so... Just know that it's a lot. But um, I've been ripping around it all day. I haven't even been able to pick up the camera. Um, a lot of stuff is going on off of camera, like, I'm trying to deal with. And, you know, one thing I'm just tired of people thinking they can just talk to me any kind of way or run over me or treat me any kind of way. I'm just done with that. Like, I'm tired of people trying to think that they can control me you don't control no one controls me but me um you don't have no leverage over me you can't tell me how to how to live where to move to and think you just okay so we already know who she's talking about she's talking about philip now you know what the only re um reason why philip would even have a problem with jasmine moving is if she moves you know a distance away you know, um, she could just only probably be 30 to 45 minutes on the road up to her house or whatnot. But nonetheless, you know, I believe he knows how Jasmine is. Jasmine is what once he once he gets the kids and then it's time for Jasmine to come pick them, pick them up. Like, let's say Philip is their arrangement. Philip go gets the kids from Jasmine's house. OK. And then. When Jasmine, when it's Jasmine's turn to grab the kids, she'll come to Philip's house. But Jasmine's going to come up with an excuse. I don't have no gas money. That's what she's going to say. She's going to say that in hopes that Philip can keep the kids longer. She's like, I don't have no gas. I don't have no gas. I don't have that much money. Da-da-da-da. I can't make it over there. So, um, yeah, I might have some money um, in a couple of days. So I'll just come get them in a couple of days. You know, that's that, that's that, that's what Jazz, that's her mentality. That's the only reason why she would even want to move away is because of that. She doesn't want to have to deal with the other kids being there uh, all the time. She wants, you know, a certain somebody to come through and stay. Just everything, you know, I'm just, it's just a lot, y'all. But um, for the most part, I got a lot of stuff done today. Did y'all know when you, move and you transferring your mail over and you're transferring your kids mail over now they make it to where you have your birth you have to have your kids birth certificate on hand i've never had to have their birth certificate when i transferred mail um so well jasmine you haven't moved in three years so girl a whole lot of stuff changes <laughs> come on i would have to go back and get their birth certificates i didn't have that with me on hand so i was like oh, God, i'm trying to get everything situated but you know, it's all right. I'm not really tripping when it comes to that. I just thought I would handle that another day. But I had, like, I'm not going to lie, y'all. This move has been so stressful. Are you eating? Eat it. 
that I just is like I've been kind of eating. Thirsty hair? Neat. Okay, come on, chick. This last week and I hate that. Like I, I haven't worked out. I worked out one time this last week and I hate it. It's like I've been uh, this move has been so stressful. Are you eating? Eat it. That I just is like I've been kind of eating whatever this last week and I hate that. Like I, I haven't worked out. I worked out one time, but I just been trying to get things done and you know sometimes I gotta put other stuff on the back burner like that. So for all you gullible people out there, you know, and this is only because you already know the, the, anybody who watch Jasmine, they watch everybody, you know, anybody who talks about Jasmine and stuff like that. So to the, to the gullible people, listen to what she just said. Now, she has her hand out wanting more money, but she you just heard her say that she's been eating whatever, meaning she's been eating at the eateries. Okay, she have not been cooking anything. So you got money to go out there and eat at the eateries. But then again, you want people to turn around and cash app you money, donate to you. What, what? The fuck? Huh? I put working out on the back burner to get things done. And it, it throws my whole routine off, my working out. It throws my eating off. I start eating regular stuff, eating whatever I make him, really. Because um, the kid's not here, but they'll be here tomorrow. And I was just like, oh, I shouldn't have ate that. But I just didn't feel like cooking more than what I needed to cook at the time. And stuff is kind of packed up and things like that. So, yeah, that's what's going on. But I've been, I've been having a productive day. I need to check off a few things off my checklist that I had to get done. Because I, I will get overwhelmed if I don't make a checklist. Like, I didn't have one. And I was getting overwhelmed because I was like, oh, my God, I have so much stuff. I'm trying to jump with yeah. to take care of that. Um, so I'm going to check off a couple of things that I had to check yeah. off. And then and I didn't. Oh, that, there she is. Um, I didn't even wake up and do it. I went, baby, I was knocked out. I was knocked out. I was tired. And then when I woke up, I instantly started doing, like, applying for certain things, applying for assistance, oh, y'all. Here's your napkin. Doing my, I told, it, it was a a time that you can apply for it and I was trying to apply you had to be, do it it goes quick so I had I was up doing that and making sure all my stuff is taken care of as far as moving and things so yep that's what I got going on so I'm gonna get this stuff real quick all right so I'm back <laughs> notice how Jasmine wants to slip in that she applied for assistance just so the people won't be like oh remember when you told um that one girl who emailed you about me to help with some groceries for her kids remember when you told her to go to the caring hands well how about you take your butt there jasmine wanted to go ahead and slip that in just in case before anybody has said anything so so she could be like well yeah i did go and get assistance okay i still need more money so can you send some to my cash app Back at home, and Legends hopefully was supposed to take a nap, but he's not taking a nap. I am about to put some stuff in my car, and then I'm going to um, move it. Okay. Yeah, that's what we're doing today. Um, I haven't even told y'all yet, so I ended up finding a place. So I am moving. As y'all know, I finally found a place. But yeah, I'm going to talk more about it later. Yeah. Girl, you been found the place. Stop fucking playing. Oh, you just automatically found the place. Like yesterday, they just notified you that you can move in yesterday. Girl, it's a process. <laughs> it's a process. So you been had the place. Cut it out. Hey, hey, hey. Thinking that people just... No, they're not just going to be like, okay, you got it. Um, um. I need some more, a little bit more information. Go ahead. I'm going to send you the papers over right now. You can move it tomorrow. Have the uh, money ordered together right then and there. I'll, I'll go over some more stuff with you. I'll drop off the key. Like, girl, it's a process. She acting like she just got the place yesterday. The <laughs> fuck? Girl, she, got, she acting like she got notified yesterday. No, you didn't notified. Oh, 
Okay, we're loading up the car. I hate that she still walks like that. How do you still walk like that? I guess. It is killing me with the fucking the trash bags, but okay, I guess. Do, do what you gotta do. She said, I want y'all to get a good angle of my ass. Come here. I love you so much. Say love you. My dudes, don't try to bend over that far down. Girl, you know you cannot do it. Goodness gracious. Lord. She's about to have another fucking surgery bending down all the way just to get pleasure to kiss. Girl, kiss his forehead. I can't. I can't. What is this? Let me see. Okay. Girl. It's hot. Car is packed all the way up right now. You want water? Car is parked up. It's hot. Not a toy about to fall on him as soon as you make a turn. Um, I'm actually going to get my kids um, at, right after I drop this load off uh, from their dad's house. And then um, they're going to come help me with their stuff. But, of course, it's not going to be packed like this because I'm going to have kids in the back. So, good morning. Welcome no, back. we know, Jasmine. Didn't you say that you was about to go drop off that crap first and then go pick up the kids why did you need to clarify it with this? Like, okay, of course it's not going to be packed because this stuff won't be in here and I'll just have the kids in the back. Duh. Welcome back to another video. I also got my Premier Protein and I got me a tall cup of water, bro. Boy. I can't, I kid you not. And I got my uh, band on and I'm already sweating, so. Y'all, I got my two older ones and this one. So we're at our new place and we are about to get out. They haven't seen anything yet. So we're about to get out so that they can see. Oh my Lord Jesus, what is going on with the hair? Oh God, man. Pilla, what's going on? What's going on? Like, what, 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 your sister busy or something? The shops are busy or something. <laughs> like you don't have to take the girls to your your sister. Take them to the shop. I mean, come on, what's going on? Like I don't get it. Having them walking around like that. They gotta walk outside, walk to get in the car, walk to get out. New neighbors looking outside. Like what the fuck? Who? Huh? Like come on. Where we are, and uh, yeah, are y'all excited? Yes, I actually am very excited. <laughs> my hair looks crazy, yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah, you said you washed it, right? Yeah, <laughs> Look at that. Oh, that's what you want. So I'm like right there. Yeah. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> this is not my room. No. Nope. If it's like to the door, that's not my room. My room. My room. Oh my Where's your room? That's a twins. I mean, that's an um, 80s legend. Yeah. Oh my God. My kids are all excited, y'all. Huh? Oh my God. 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 Oh my what is this big room for? It's for me. Yeah. <laughs> Mommy, I need this room. No, it's my room. Y'all can play bass in here. <laughs> my kid. I love this. Here, let him out. Watch him out there, though. All right. Ooh, we got a tree in the backyard, too. Oh, we do? Oh, yeah, we do have one in the backyard. Yes. Look, I knew you had to go to the bathroom. This is okay. Ready? Slide it? Oh, goodness. It's bigger than the one at home. Yeah. It is, right? I'm going to move these. This is a gate for a dog gate. 
Wait, let me see. Yeah, I'm gonna move it. I don't know where to put it at though. I guess the last person here had a dog. We freaking have what's it called? Uh, and we got some still some free supplies. What's your dog gate? Like if we want to put Bentley in a gate, so so he doesn't like. We need that. But that means their dog must have been big. That was a, see how big it is. That's what yeah. I'm about to say. Uh oh, my friend, my friend come back over here, legend. My friend had that big of a dog. All right, so we're at the new place. As you guys can oh see. My God. Found a new place. It was not easy to find. Um, I'm grateful for being able to find what I can afford and finding something that is my. So everybody heard that, right? She found something that she can afford. So we don't want to hear her bringing her tail back on here talking about she needed a certain certain amount of money for um so that she can pay the rent. We don't want to hear it. Y'all heard her herself. She found something that she can afford. And you know what? Listen, it looks like it's a nice house. It had a, what, two-car garage in there? Or it's still four bedrooms, two bathrooms. I mean, it's still good. That's still a nice-ass house. Backyard seems to be like a fence backyard since she allowed Bentley to go out there. And looks still good to me price range um and still been able to accommodate the amount of kids i had so the fact that i was able to find this is just a blessing it was hard but i'm just grateful for it um i know a lot of you guys are probably asking questions like we're starting over with a lot of stuff so i don't have a couch i don't have a dining room table i have it on facebook market who what questions did you think people were going to ask jasmine you just got there your, all your stuff haven't been moved over yet. What type of questions other than congratulations what, did you think people, and congratulations is not even a question. They're just going to say congratulations. But what type of questions do you think people were going to ask you? Really? Oh, Jasmine, what about where's your couch? Where's your, no, no, who cares? Like, now y'all see how she's trying to be slick and easy in. We still don't have a couch. We still don't have a washer and dryer. We still don't have a dining room table. Well, you still got enough time to get it. What are you telling us for? The fuck? 20, what, the 20th, 21st about to be here in what, two weeks? <laughs> what you telling us for? You got it. The fuck? You already paid this month's rent. You got it. It's affordable. Ain't nobody telling you to go out there and buy a two thousand fucking dollar um a sofa set or a one thousand dollar dining set. Nobody telling you to do this. Get what you can afford. That we're not we're not doing anything. We're not going to keep on funding your lifestyle, Jasmine. You have to learn how to step out there yourself. Jasmine has to be a big girl. All the gullible people who usually give her money, let her be a big girl. She's a grown ass woman. I don't even have a washer and dryer. So right now, everything is strictly, like at the moment, we're only going to the, uh, get off that, I don't want to get my wall dirty. We're only going to be going to, yeah, give me some water. We're going to be going to like the laundromat. There's nothing wrong with going to the laundromat. Utilize what's there until you can get what you want. You know how many people go to the damn laundromat? And who said it was a problem, Jasmine? Start being positive. Why you just she say something and then she it turns negative? There's nothing wrong with going. Who said it was? A, that, a lot of people go to the laundromat. Who cares? You do what you gotta do. As far as couch and table, I sold my couch and table to get the rest of my rent. So I, I thought you could afford this. Not you, Jasmine. Cut it out talking about you sold your damn sofa and your cat. What your sofa and your dining set? Cut it out. Cut it out. You're not going. She's not. You're not going to sell us on that you're broke and you don't have no money. Let me tell y'all something. This is another thing for all the gullible people who likes to give Jasmine cash apps and to you know Jasmine's dumbass mods over there. Um, this year has been very lucrative for Jasmine. Okay, her views have gone way up. She's been getting a lot of money for these past few paychecks from YouTube. 
she has. My thing is, if she is talk, if she's um, you know, close to being broke or whatnot like that, or you know, her funds are low after she gets her YouTube check, who you giving money to? Stop giving that loser money. Cause that's the only one who can actually get anything out of Jasmine. He don't have to do nothing. All he has to do is have conversation with her. That's it. And she'll just give it all up to him. Who are you giving money to? Because these past few months, Jasmine has been getting some big YouTube checks better than what she has ever gotten. So what's going on? Don't be trying to fucking play like you broke. You're not broke. So that um, I did what I had to do in a short period of time and Sometimes you just have to do what you have to do. So to provide for your kids, my kids, they're happy that it is a little bit of like, a, I guess you could say a downgrade as far as appliances, cabinets, but there are things that I can do DIYs to up my house to make me feel comfortable in it, make me feel like, you know, like it's the luxury stuff. So even if I get furniture, I can do things. I can do, like I said, DIYs. I'm just grateful to have a place. Um, we do have like the old school blinds in here. Right now, it's just, it's okay. Um, we do have some wooden blinds. I think it's in the boys' room and- Who cares? Why are you discussing, discussing blinds with us, Jasmine? Who cares? They're shades. Who cares? You're in a home. You have a house that you said that you can afford but then turn around and say you have to sell furniture. But still, you said that you can afford it. You're in a new house. It has four bedrooms, two, maybe two and a half bathrooms. It looks nice. It looks spacious. Two-car garage. Girl, in a fenced-in backyard. Hello. Let's be happy and joyous about that. Let's not nitpick and say, well, you know, the old um the old appliances and the wooden blinds. Who cares? Who cares? Maybe the girls' room. I don't know. But it's fine. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with what I have. Okay, I ran out of storage. My kids are okay. We're okay. You just do what you have to do at this point. And that's what I'm doing. So, um, you know, we have our place. It is what it is. Like, sometimes you got to do what you got to do. So, um, after that, it's like I'm moving stuff little by little. Uh, all the big stuff will be here on, we'll, we'll move on. I'm going to have all my big stuff. What is he trying for? Legend now, baby. Can you just give him something? All my big stuff will be moved on Sunday. Uh, what is he crying about? Okay, it's not hard for you to stop talking for a minute. Girl acting like she lied or something. Jasmine, hello. You can say whatever you got to say at another time. You is not in dire need to get it out. Girl done, girl done been shot this video days ago. Maybe even over a week ago. Like, girl, you acting like you, you, you act, she acting like she Nika and uploads a video within the same day of shooting it. Stop and go see what the hell going on with him. Uh, hey, hey, you okay? I know. I've been the one in there. Can you get him? Mom, like, so, like I said. Do what you have to do. Um. So I was watching this video last night and my daughter, who's 13, you know, she was she watched it with me as well. When we when we um, saw this part, my daughter was like, she need to go get that baby. How is a 13 year old got more common sense than you? She said, you need to go get that baby. He all in the background being loud as hell. And you still proceeding to talk to us like we can hear you over him. Um, to provide for your kids. It's real hollow because there's really nothing in here. I have nothing to lie about. I don't have no furniture. But we got to. Okay, Jasmine. But you have a house. Furniture will come once again. That's what... You're about to get paid in what, two weeks? <laughs> I mean, what? 
Then you say you call some assistant places. They didn't, uh, you know, reference you to some furniture places. Oh, okay. So you didn't really call them. Oh, got it, got it. My bad. My bad. I didn't want to spoil anything. But girl, it'll come. Got a roof. That's all that matters, right? Um, what else is I gonna tell y'all? And you know what? For people who will say, well, T, you say that Nika needs to get furniture. No, no. Mm -mm. Jazz and Nika are two different people. Nika's kids been without furniture for what, seven plus years? At almost seven years, they've been without furniture. And I'm talking about every motherfucking thing. No beds, no couch, no couch, no sofas, no dining set, no nothing. So it's a difference. The fuck, Jasmine's kids had it. They can go a week, a couple weeks, or until she finds, you know, um, some furniture on Marketplace, because that's where she's going to look. Until she finds that, you know, we know she's going to get it. Nika's kids been without it for too fucking long. That's just it. Like, do what you have to do. Now, my next thing, like I said, I'm going to be looking on Facebook Market, trying to find things. Um, yeah, that's my next move. Is looking on Facebook Market, uh, looking for places, trying to, like, get stuff gently used. You kind of just slowly build everything up, you know what I'm saying? You want the whole world to know how sick you are. Sure. Where the hell is my fucking Tylenol? Shit. I got me a fucking headache. I'm going to start from the bottom and work your way up. So here I am. So I brought my clothes just now. I already made a couple of trips before I got the kids. But I got my clothes um, that were in hanging up. So I'm going to put my stuff up in my room. And um, we have so much stuff we have to get. Legend is so mad right now because he wants Kaylin's stuff. But he can't have her stuff. Her ukulele is one of those uh, vintage ukuleles. And he wants it. And I feel her like, no, we have my stuff. And we bought him some. So you just allow him to cry over something that he cannot have. That's how you know he's spoiled. You sit him down, tell him no, he ain't having it. And if he want to keep on crying, put his ass over there and time out. Shit, crying for no damn reason over something that's not his. And he, you said he, you said he can't have it. Why is he? Why is he still right there crying? His butt would have been to a motherfucking corner. Because we already know Jasmine's not going to hit him. So he will be over there to that damn corner. Why the hell are you allowing him to cry and be spoiled like that? He crying like that because you always give him everything. Then not. Shoot. He would have been got that tail tapped. Some toys over here. So he has toys too. So um, I'm about to get her TV out so that she could hook up the internet and just let him. I mean, hook up the Wi-Fi. Hook it up so he can watch TV. It's easier when he's watching it and he's sitting and chilling and not bothering stuff. So I'm about to look at that real quick. All right, so I just stopped and got the kids something. We got something to eat because it's already four. Huh, huh. <laughs> Strap for cash, but we stopping at a fast food eatery. Come on now, come on. 53 and I'm about to go get my twins. Um, yeah, I'm tired. I just went and helped my mama clean up her house what? as well. So we about to go and get the twins well, now. All right, come on. Whoa. Mama, I know it's right here. Aiden, it's your room. I haven't been in here yet. <laughs> all right, so I'm going to just show y'all. First of all, we have like a lot of ants. I noticed around here, like big, big ants. So Ooh. I got this ant, roach, and spiders. Man, I, I kill, I'm going to show y'all. It's in the bathroom. It's a big old spider, too. Um, I need to pick it up, but... I got some more soap. Um, we got a three pack of Febreze, some bleach. Uh uh. Strapped for cash, but we out here buying three packs of Febreze, a big ass thing of fucking soap. What is that right there? This big ass thing of fucking trash bags, but you strapped for cash? Huh? You strapped for cash, you better only get one motherfucking Febreze. <laughs> um, actually, she would have been getting a dollar spray from Dollar Tree. Getting a Dollar Tree um, trash bags, uh, what, three bars of soap? <laughs> you ain't strapped for cash? Uh, uh-uh. Some more uh, trash bags, 
some toilet paper. I got actually I have two things of this, but I'm going to wash oh, clothes. No. Not the big ass thing of motherfucking toilet paper. <laughs> and it's big ass thing of some, um, the, um, dishwasher pots. Don't get me started on this big ass thing of fucking laundry detergent. Girl, stop it. And you got the pods too? <laughs> Woo wee, all my autumn gullible people. Tonight um, at my house, so I left one in the car. I got some pods, some uh, dishwashing pods, some dishwashing liquid, just a bucket and a broom, a new broom and mop. It was just time. Um, that's everything as far as this little mini quick grocery, y'all. Like, girl, child, I still got to go back and get, um, what is it called, y'all? A bathroom set for their bathroom. So I got to get that. But yeah. I... Oh. Okay, okay. Let me see where we at. Let me see where we at. Oh, okay. We at the 36 mark. Mm, do I want to save the other one for tomorrow? I think it's only a little bit though. But I'm gonna think I'm gonna just I'm gonna go ahead and do that video later on tonight because I gotta hurry up and cook. And um, yeah, yeah, y'all. We'll do her other video and I'll release it either t tonight or early morning tomorrow. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, like this video, comment your thoughts down below and subscribe. And remember to my gullible people, Jasmine got money. She can afford this place. Um, I mean, you know, listen, if she does a registry, she does a registry. But, you know, it is what it is at this point. You know, Jasmine... Jasmine can get it herself. We gotta let her be a big girl. Gotta let her